After a 6-3 victory, the Los Angeles Dodgers look to pull out the sweep against the Seattle Mariners on Wednesday night. And we have a money-making opportunity on a player prop for this game. Hi, I'm Steve Seagrave from SportsMemo.com. If you guys enjoy the content, hit the like button, subscribe to the Wager Talk channel, and let us know who you got in the comment section, whether it be a side, a total, a player prop. I'll be checking those comments, responding back to you guys throughout the night. So we end up with a tough push last night. We had the under in this same series, under nine Mariners Dodgers. It ends six to three Los Angeles. It was three to three in the eighth inning. It was looking pretty good. Dodgers poured it on a little bit too much. We were fortunate uh, with a late play at the plate going our way. But um, we'll look to get back on track today. We're still eight, six, and one. It was our first push for the month of August. We look to get back on track with the winner today. Dodgers, Mariners, first pitch, 10-10 p.m. Eastern from Dodger Stadium. Game will be featured on the MLB Network. Dodgers, negative 175 on the money line. M's, plus 145. And we got a low total, 7.5. Two pretty solid right-handed pitchers going toe-to-toe in this one. We got Logan Gilbert for the Mariners, 7-9. 2.96 on the ERA, a spotty whip, 0.88. On the whip, Flaherty going for the Dodgers. 9-5 record, 3.06 on the ERA, 1.01 on the whip. He's coming off a start where he allowed three earned runs across five innings in Milwaukee against the Brewers. And he's had three starts now under his belt since joining the Dodgers. 3.78 ERA across 16 and two-thirds innings. So he's been pretty solid since joining the Dodgers. And uh, he prefers to pitch at home, so he should be pretty. He should be in for a pretty solid start here. On the other side of things, Gilbert coming off a start where he allowed three earned runs. Uh, he did allow four runs total, but three were earned across six and a thirds innings in Pittsburgh against the Pirates. And he's a pitcher that, like kind of a lot of these pitchers on this Mariner staff, he's been a lot better at home. Two point five three ERA at home on the road. Three point three eight. ERA. Before we get into the player prop that I really like a lot for this game, I want to let you guys know today is 50% off day over at Wager Talk only. So all single plays and day passes right now are 50% off over there. But tomorrow we're kicking off a great special for the 10th anniversary of Wager Talk. It's fill your cart for four days. Everything will be 30% off from Thursday through Sunday. Um, We'll talk more about that in tomorrow's video. I am in action today with an MLB play. I have a 4%er. We're on a 14-7 and seven and run for 4% MLB plays. And I'll be posting a WNBA play as well. Uh, so we don't really need to get into the bullpen breakdowns for this game. And I do lean Dodgers laying the run and a half here uh, at plus money. You get some pretty good plus money at plus 124. Better offense. And I think the starting pitcher is in a better situation as well. However, at home, laying that run and a half can sometimes be a, a tricky situation. So we're going to go with the player prop for this one. We're going to be looking at Flaherty, the starter here. Over seven and a half strikeouts. It is a big number. But since joining the Dodgers, he's had seven, ten, and seven strikeouts. He's went over in five of his last eight home starts while averaging 8.1 strikeouts per game. And the 10 strikeout performance with the Dodgers was in his lone home game. The two sevens were on the road. Now he's facing the Mariners. Highest K rate in the majors. Current Mariners only batting 189 against Flaherty. And they have 23 strikeouts against him in only 55 plate appearances. That equates to a 41.8 strikeout rate against Flaherty. Uh, the M's have been striking out against righties all season long. Flaherty's been striking him out. Uh, he's an elite strikeout pitcher, and at home he really seems to thrive. He's had seven at least in every start. We need eight out of them tonight. So let's go over seven and a half strikeouts on Jack Flaherty tonight. That'll be our official play for the video. Uh, there'll be a link to my sports memo page attached in the pinned comment. I always have free plays posted on X at Steve's Book 22, as well as at sportsmemo.com. If you guys enjoy the content, do me a favor on the way out, hit that like button, and I'll see you guys tomorrow.